have you ever thought about what makes the perfect holiday destination for you? For me, it's somewhere warm, ideally somewhere tropical. Warm water, great beaches, sun, and most importantly, brilliant food. And when I come to the Cocos, I could go down the road to the Cocos Club or come to this place, Saltmakers by the Sea. It's a great example of the wonderful local produce that gets used and every night they have a different theme featuring this freshly sourced ingredients. Speaking of food, maybe a cooking course or two, something you can do whilst here on the Cocos Keeling Islands. With the strong Cocos Malay influences, the chance to learn traditional Cocos Malay cuisine is awesome. But in a partnership with the Cocos Island High School and the Home Island Elders, it's an awesome way to share their culture with visitors and give the high school students the opportunity to practice their English. Now I'm really excited because I've fallen in love with Cocos Malay food. There's been the pandan pancakes with coconut inside and then the curry puffs absolutely delicious and I'm hoping that I might be able to learn a couple of cooking skills that I can take home with me that'll remind me of the Cocos forever. That's the beauty about these cooking schools. Can't wait. So I'm looking forward to today's dishes. First up, the kids are showing the class how to make a favourite amongst the Cocos Malay community. Curry puffs. This is easy. It's just pick it up, pop it in the hand. Yep. <laughs> and then make sure you pinch this part. You've got to pinch that yep. part. All right. So it just stays together. Yep. Hold it over like that. Does that look anything like? No, it doesn't. The aromas of all the different meals being cooked overwhelms your senses. This class gives you the opportunity to learn about each of the dishes being cooked. So, what what is this called? It's, it's called kuedada. Kuedada and it's effectively a coconut inside a pancake. Yes. This pancake mix is green. That's because of the... Pandan. Pandan. Yeah. Okay, and so you'd start with the pandan paste? You start with the um, flour. With flour. flour. And then mix with um, coconut milk. Right. And then after that you just eat the... Um, Make the thin pancake. And then this is the, the central ingredient. So this is shredded coconut? Yes. Bread, fresh. Shredded coconut with palm sugar. Yeah. Cooked in palm sugar. Cooked in palm sugar. Yes. And then it's just popped into the middle. Yep. Like this. And then the trick is the roll, isn't it? Yeah. From the, yeah. On the side. Yes. And then yes. roll it like this. And that yep. is pretty pretty much it. That's, that's how it should be. Yes. We work studiously at preparing and there's a lot of laughs and chat along the way. It's a lot of fun. Cokes Malay people are such friendly, happy folk and generous, which makes the whole experience feel like you're a very special guest. After the cooking session, it's time to eat and we share the food in a big, happy, long table meal, much the way the locals would normally. What a wonderful way to spend a day, getting immersed in a little bit of cooking so you can bring this amazing culture back home with it. Good work, Chris. <laughs> now, if you want to know how to book this, all you have to do is simply go to the visitor centre. It's that easy. <laughs>